What's up? It just occurred to me that when I'm throwing black guitar picks, you can't really see it. So, what's up everyone and welcome to Sunday with Ola 56. Welcome guys. What an intro. Let us start off with this. This right here. Hello. It's a fan fret solar guitar. Hello. Cool, huh? There's more information on the solar guitar's website. I'm not going to talk too much about the guitar, okay? Check some website. And shit, but look at this fucking fan fret, man. How about that? Our first fan fret guitar available in six and seven strings. Baby, let me let me just fix that little thing right there. Look at that. Hello, what's up? I have to say, before I started recording this uh, little video right here, I've been a little bit nervous. Uh, why have Ola England, the absolute mastodon of a Swede, been nervous? And what has he been nervous about? Well, uh, the thing is that me and Luis, uh, for the past time, I would say, and ever since we actually had a dog, we we're looking at, at uh, getting a new dog, basically. And uh, we found one that we, uh, we're not looking into getting a puppy or something like that. We're trying to get something that's, you know, like one year old, something like that. So yeah, a, a dog that needs a home. We found one that uh, basically ticked all of our boxes. Yesterday, we've been talking to the owner and maybe we're going there to go meet the dog and say hi. So, uh, I'm a little anxious right now because I have no idea how it will go. Uh, me and Luis, we really want to have a dog again because dogs are amazing. And uh, yes, so I'm really hoping for it to happen. Maybe that will be the adventures with Ola later in the video. You know, but since I'm recording this before then, I have no idea if it's going to be in there or not. We're just gonna have to see. Anyways, I'm ex I'm excited. I'm nervous. Uh, look at me. A usual summer day like this, I would wear shorts, but I'm not. I'm wearing long pants because people can't handle my legs. Well, if you can't handle my legs, can you handle these socks? They are uh, they are purple. Just saying. I'm just gonna have these up here all video now. If you guys have a problem with it, then go seek help. I don't know. Anyways, Swola 56. What's up? Let's just get on with the news already. Okay, okay, okay. I don't think it has escaped anyone that uh, Ibanez released their new Iron Label guitars. And uh, Iron Label, that's cool. Black guitars, I mean, the world needs more black guitars in my opinion. Uh, why is that? Well, because black is the best color out there, just saying. Anyways, they released a bunch of cool different guitars, but... Holy shit, can we just talk about them releasing an Iceman 7-string, finally? Holy shit, man, look at... Oh, no, I can't look at it, because if I hold my mouse over it, it disappears. Phew! Uh, where is it? Where is it going? <laughs> Alright, oh, let's see, let's see. Oh my god, look at this. Yeah, man. You know, I would love for it to be a tunematic bridge. Just saying, that would have been like the icing on the cake right there. But this is okay. The Iron Label guitars has the Marcio uh, deactivators. I don't know about the other guitars. Maybe they're different. But I mean, uh, the Iceman, man. A black Iceman. What? Now everyone can get an Iceman. They're so fucking cool. Must say. Look at this. How cool is that? And there's also the Cyphos. 
Can you see? There it is. <sighs> Shit. That is f***ing cool, I must say. Does this also have the deactivators? Yes, it does. Okay, Ebony Fretborn. Okueme body. Okay. Uh, maple Walnut Neck Through. Holy shit, okay. Locking Nut Black. Shit. Goto Machine Heads. Edge Zero Two Tremolo. Uh, side Dot Luminance Net. Uh, side Dot, that's cool. Yeah, man. I I think Ivan has really did a good job on these. I mean, obviously the the winner here, in my opinion, was the Iceman Seven. It's uh, it's incredibly beautiful. But we're also going to check out what Jackson put to the table because Jackson announced their new Made in Japan series. Uh, well, it's not new, but they're they're making guitars in Japan again. And uh, look at these. You have a bunch of different dinkies. You have oh, Misha Mansour. Look at this. Like a Fender Stratish kind of thing right there. Uh, you have a bunch of dinkies. Oh, 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 look at this. You're basically juggling guitars like this on the website. That's cool. And look at this MJ Series Rhodes RRT. You know what's cool about this guitar right here? Click on it. Look at that thing. 2700 bucks. <sighs> That's a lot. But... It's a really cool looking guitar. I mean, take a look at this. Take a look at that. Isn't that amazing? You know what's more amazing? That I have one right here that I'm meant to demo. Let me bring it out. I just have to remove my socks real quick. I placed it pretty close to me so I could reach it without taking my microphone off. I still have to make a demo of this thing, but oh my God, look at this. Ooh. Look at that. Hello. Made in Nippon, as they say. And if, dude. That's a nice guitar right there. Just saying, holy shit. And uh, I'm still to make a demo of this guitar, but I am going to make a video. <laughs> what the fuck was that? I don't know. It was like a ghost burp. It, it was meant to be a burp, but never got there. It disappeared. Anyways, those are the Jackson made in Japan right there. Holy shit, I'm excited. Another thing we have to talk about is the insane Hellfest lineup for 2022. What? So, I don't know if you guys saw this, but basically they're doing a seven day festival now this, uh, this next year. And have you seen the lineup? Where's the picture? I don't know where the picture is, but there's a lot of names on the ban list right there. Look at this asshole right here. Basically, they have the uh, 2020 lineup right there, you know, with the pandemic hit. Uh, when the pandemic hit, sorry. So they're basically doing two festivals in one. A three-day first uh, festival right there, and then a four-day right there. Holy shit! Look at these bands, man. I'm just reading the top ones, okay? Deftones, Faith No More, Avenged Sevenfold, Scorpions, Nine Inch Nails, Guns N' Roses, Metallica. Let's continue. Megadeth, Korn, Whitesnake, Ministry, Airborne, Black Label Society, Volbeat, Deep Purple, Judas Priest, Wardruna. Okay. Alice Cooper, Nightwish, Sabaton, Five Finger Death Punch, Airborne, Halloween, Megadeth, Epic. I mean, holy shit. I think this is the lineup of lineups for a festival right here. I haven't seen this packed of a festival before, I think. I mean, look at, you scroll down, there's a shit ton of really cool bands who had. You, Carcass. Allegedly, it's all sold out by now. So you don't have to worry about, you know, uh, hurrying up to get tickets. I guess it's all sold out by now. But it's a really impressive list. And, uh, it, you know, I also see a lot of bands uh, announcing their, their tours now for the, uh, later of the year, which is really nice to see that we're finally getting back into shit and uh, maybe do a live show or two. Uh, with the Honda, we're planning to tour in September. I really, really hope it will happen because I'm really looking forward to of, uh, of playing live again. But take a look at this again. Anyways, that was the news for this week. Short and sweet. As Luis uh, calls it. Who's up there? You won't escape that way. Right. So, as I mentioned before, 
I'm going out of town right now. I'm actually gonna pick up the rest of the family. We're all going. Uh, pretty far of a trip, it's a five hour trip uh, to go and visit uh, this potential dog that uh, we've been looking at. And um, I'm basically shaking right now. I'm very nervous just because, you know, expectations. Both me and Louise have been longing for a dog for uh, for a long time now. For those of you who don't know, we had a dog uh, almost 10 years back, uh, a miniature bull terrier, Busse. It was a lovely dog, it eventually passed away. And I took the passing of him very, very hard to the point where I said I would never get a dog again. But uh, at the same time, you know, dogs, they offer so much love it, it was just a matter of time before we would get another dog. So I'm really, really hoping that this will turn out good. And uh, obviously we're bringing the whole family because it's so important that it works for everyone in the family. And then we'll just have to see what happens, you know? seems that we might have the gods against us today. We've been in so many traffic jams. Uh, for two and a half hours we've been riding a car, but we haven't haven't gone far at all. So maybe it's maybe it's a sign. Maybe we, we're not meant to have a dog right now. too many hours now my family's getting insane they're making they're making weird noises exactly Same. still a long way to go holy shit Cool bye. All right. We're finally at the hotel. So we're gonna meet the dog tomorrow. We checked in at the hotel. Here's a map. So we went all the way from here and now we're down here. That's sweet. Look at that. So yeah. Sunday with all our ref challenge. You know, the song that I played in the beginning there was something I, was, I challenged myself to write for the purpose of this video. And those drums that you heard there in the beginning, you can download those drums in the description of this video. You can make your own riffs, upload it to YouTube and to the Swola Riff Challenge subreddit and maybe I'll feature you in the Swola. How about that? And we're gonna check out last week's contribution or last last week's because it was two weeks ago. So let's check it out. What's this? Uh, this is U21 Mop 98, my third entry for the Rift Challenge. Hope you guys dig it. Uh, let's see, I'm gonna turn off the music. There we go. He's using a dinky. Riffy. He's using a Boss Katana into a 2x12, I think. Unless he's going direct. That's cool. Well done, man. That was 21 mop 98. Well done. Next up, we have Steven Reinhardt. Let's go. Oh, 
the SF5150 EVH, 50 watt, and a solar, of course. This could have been an arch enemy song, man. Dude, I can see it. He's a weeb. Look at that computer right, right there. That's a nice little setup you have there. There it is, man. Dude, that was sick. Steven Reinhardt, well done. Tasserous music. Yeah, man. The best part about watching these is just to hear how different everyone thinks when they write something for the drums. I mean, the drums are the same, but everyone writes different shit. And that's the coolest part about all of this. I mean, this guy's rocking an SG. Tostrous music. Dude, well done. That was sick. All right, last but not least, we have Mike Owens. Mike Owens is the guy who's always first in the Sunday with Ola and Metal Morning premiere. Just saying. I bet you're as Uno, you know? That's what's important. Oh, look at that little doggy. Oh. I can't stop thinking about that dog, man. I really hope it happens. Not to take away from your <laughs> riffs here because they're amazing. But yeah, it's really hard for me to think right now. I think clearly at least. All I can think of uh, is that dog. You have a beautiful dog there, that's all I can think about. Even though the riffs are stanky as f woof, 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 woof. Dude, that was sick. Oh, I want a dog so bad, man. All right. Do we- uh, f me. Look at this. I'm going Super Saiyan. If you want to be a part of the Rift Challenge, download the drums in the description of this video, upload to YouTube, go post it in the Sunday with Ola Rift Challenge subreddit, and maybe I'll feature you in the next one. How about that? Thank you so much for everyone that's participating. It, it is really inspiring to see what you guys come up with. Uh, and uh, it forces us to write music, and that's what it's all about. Remember this, it's not a competition, okay? Do it for yourself. I'm fixing my mustache, just saying. All right, but my friends, that was it for Sunday with Ola 56 today. Uh, I hope you enjoyed it, and I really, really hope that uh, you guys weren't distracted by me being distracted about thinking about a dog this whole episode. Uh, but yeah, I, I really hope that uh, we get this dog right here. Uh, I've been longing for a dog for a long, long time. You know, I said after our uh, previous dog that it would take a long time for me to get another dog because it hurts so much when uh, Bosse passed. Uh, it, it's, it was probably the worst time for me ever in my life uh, when that happened. But you know, even though that hurt a lot, you know, dogs bring so much love. So I, I, you can't just pass up on getting another dog, even though the lifespans are way too short. But uh, yeah, I really, really hope that it went well. Just saying that, okay? Uh, what am I saying? Thank you so much for watching, guys. Hope you have an excellent Sunday, and I'll see you guys soon. Next week is a metal morning, okay? Thank you for watching, guys. Bye. We went to visit the dog. And here she is. Look at this little, little puppy right here. Hello. Hey. Hey. Hey, Gina. Hey, Gina. Come and hey, buddy. No, hey. No. Oh, my God. No, no, no. You're so cute. 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 So, yeah, we got a dog.